Hello and welcome here. Warner Brothers has finally released brand new teaser for Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom, which will be released in December. Jason Momoa will reprise his role as the title DC hero in Aquaman 2 and Square Battle against Yahya Abdul-Mateen II's Black Manta, who had a billion-dollar debut in the original Aquaman film. Warner Brothers has yet to truly begin its marketing campaign for Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom, even though the DC film won't even have a true trailer until now. Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom will arrive in theaters in little over three months. DC has published a teaser video for Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom that lasts 30 seconds. The official trailer will be released on Thursday. The suspense of the upcoming film is immediately established by the action-packed trailer, which has Black Manta adamantly stating, I'm gonna kill Aquaman and destroy everything he holds dear. The next image shows Momoa's Arthur Curry coming across the charred ruins of his father's house. The vivid underwater action of Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom is then shown in a series of quick clips, including a peak of Arthur's battle with Black Manta. So what to expect from the official trailer for Aquaman 2? Recently, it was in doubt if Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom would arrive in theaters in December since studios refused to provide unions a fair agreement and put a stop to the writers' and actors' strikes. The renowned Dune Part 2 has already been postponed by Warner Brothers from November to March 2024 because performers would be unable to promote it due to the strikes. However, the studio has reiterated Aquaman 2's 2023 release date and started its marketing campaign with the publication of the aforementioned trailer. The final film in the now-defunct DCEU will be Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom, although James Gunn and Peter Safran will revive the linked series with Superman Legacy in 2025. It is unclear whether Aquaman will play a part in the updated DC Universe, but Momoa has made it clear that she is in good terms with Gunn and Safran. However, it wouldn't be unexpected if the official trailer emphasizes that Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom marks the end of an era. With the stakes of their struggle with Black Manta mounting, as shown above, the idea that this would be Aquaman's final conflict might help generate interest in the movie. Additionally, new returning stars who weren't seen in the teaser will probably make their debut appearance in the Aquaman and the Lost Kingdom trailer. Patrick Wilson, Nicole Kidman, and the aforementioned Abdul Mateen are briefly spotted in the trailer, but other major Aquaman 2 cast members like Dolph Lundgren and Amber Heard aren't featured in any detail, although Heard's Mera may be seen in the picture with the burning Curry Mansion. There will probably be more of the narrative from Aquaman and the Lost Kingdom in the future teaser. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.